I'm Anna Bellinghausen. Welcome into Dominican League Royals Live here with Wilson Benamy Jr. Wilson, how has it been down in the Dominican League? What have you learned so far? Tell me about it. First of all, first of all I want to thank you. I feel excited, happy. My first time here. Oh, it's great because it's something that I have been waiting a long time, dreaming. Now I'm here. I only need to work hard. You know that work space off. I'm going to be at the big least. I only need to be consistent. Yes, Wilson. And you're with a lot of guys your age, a lot of young ones just hoping to get their, their spot on the roster, keep moving up in the organization. What's the competition been like playing with these guys every day? I could say that I don't see this like a competition because they are my boss. We treat us like I help him and he help me because I don't want like him to be like on a bad rate. Can we say that? Reputation. Bad reputation, I could say. I want good for him and good for me. That's a, that's is to that is like being a teammate. Yes, exactly. Uh, are you guys pretty close, you would say, then? Uh, Ethan mentioned you guys are real close, like brothers almost. Uh, what are the relationships like on the team? Like with other teams? Mm -hmm. I got no, friends. With your, with your team. Great. It's great. They help me and they, I, I help them. Yes. Uh, what have you kind of learned from the other guys on the team then? I'm sure you guys all come from different places. What has stuck out to you most about your teammates? You know that some players know more than me. They help me when I don't know something. That's a cool thing about them. That's yes, and I mentioned this to Ethan earlier, World Series flag right behind you for the Royals. Does that serve as some motivation to wanting to get to the MLB? A lot. Like he said, they were here. Now they are there. That, that said us that we can be there too. Yeah, and what kind of motivates you just to keep going every day? I mean, it's a grind, a 60-game season. What motivates me? Uh, my dad, my mom, my family, my teammates too, everybody. Yes, Wilson, and your dad, you just mentioned him. He played in the majors. He actually played with the Royals for, I think, a season, 2010. So did he uh, say something to you when you uh, got on that blue uniform and joined the Royals? Yeah, he feels good because he's proud about me. Every day that I play in a game, he tells me, good job, good job. He always gives me advice. That's something great, having a dad that play baseball. And now with me, he's cool because he, I saw him when I was a child. Now he's selling me. That's great. And did you get to visit uh, a lot of the stadiums and a lot of the games when you were a kid? Yeah. I was a Kaufman Stadium, too. Yeah. Yankee, Dodgers. Many places. So you kind of grew up around baseball. So joining the Royals and pursuing your dream of being a professional baseball player was kind of a no-brainer for you. What can you tell again, please? Yeah. So joining the Royals and becoming a baseball player that just seemed natural for you. Yeah. I don't see like something like new. It feels the same, but now I'm a player. Mm -hmm. I could say. Yes. Well. Are there any goals you have for yourself for the end of the season as you guys wrap up your your league there? My God, my goal is like trusting in God and being consistent. That's my goal. Because this game is like making the same thing next day and next day and the next day. I only need like being like and good, good. Hell, good hell. I only need good hell. That's the only thing I need. Yes, for sure. Well, thank you so much, Wilson. Good luck the rest of the season. I can't wait to see you and all you do, and hopefully see you at Coffin Stadium soon. Thank you. The same. I got a question for you. Yes, hit me with it. Uh, what motivates you making your job? What's the best thing? What motivates me, like, in my job? Yeah. Oh, I would just say – you know, watching people before me, like Erin Andrews, if you know her, like Sam Ponder and Mina Kimes, those those women I look up to a lot and seeing them on ESPN and seeing them call the Super Bowl, you know, being on the sideline and whatnot. I think that uh, that motivates me a lot is seeing other women do it. And just, I want to be there. I want to be in their shoes. Kind of like you with professional baseball, but me on the other Wait, stages. Would you be there? 
Yeah, I'm hoping I'll be there. Yeah. Thank you, Anna. Thank you so much, Wilson. You have a good one.